backing up, backing up, backing up. All right. So, arm styling in international rumble. So let's start first of all without uh, doing any steps. Let's just let's just first of all uh, work a little bit on our arms without having any steps, so we don't really make it too difficult and too confu confusing uh, right uh, from the very beginning. So this is what I want everyone to do in the beginning. Right arm. It's gonna go out like this, and then I'm gonna return in. Again, right arm goes out, it's completely straight, and then it comes back in like this, like you would be almost hugging yourself during this crazy time, right? So, again, I start my movement by using the elbow, and only at the very end I straighten my arm. And now, as I'm bringing my arm in, I rotate my arm, and also the elbow is leaning my way back in, and then at the very end I'm finishing by placing my arm basically on my waist here. And again, so for now, let's just concentrate on one arm. So let's say we're doing the right arm. Goes out, straight, rotate, in, and then your hand goes on the waist. And again, elbow out, straight, rotate, in, here. Okay, I'm gonna turn around now. So, my arm goes, again, elbow is leading, goes out, here, rotate, in, here. Arm goes out, straight, rotate in and then my hand goes here on the waist and arm goes out straight rotate and then in comes back here okay let's try to do the same thing with the left arm okay i'm gonna do a little bit less times so the same thing left arm goes out straight Rotate, so my palm is facing the ceiling right now. And then I will come in here, and then the hand goes on my waist. And out, straight, rotate, in, and then waist. Elbow, and then straight, rotate, in, and then on my waist. All right. I think we're doing just fine right now. So let's try to do both arms at the same time. Even to me, it sounds already difficult. But let's give it a try, okay? So we're gonna start very slowly. I'm gonna be facing you and afterwards I'm gonna turn around. So let's start by bringing the right arm out first. So as my right arm comes out, I'm gonna keep my left hand on my waist already. So my right arm comes out here, it goes all the way straight, and then I, after I rotate my arm, as my right arm is gonna start coming in towards my body, my left arm is slowly going out, and then it's switching places like this. So for right now, I just would like you to keep your fingers completely like this, straight. You don't have to do anything with your fingers. It goes out here, my right arm now is on my waist and rotate, comes in as my right arm goes out, here. So it's straight and this hand is on my waist. Here we go again. And right arm comes in, my left arm goes out and then this is the end position here, yes. And left arm is rotating, the elbow goes in and the right arm goes out to the side here. And rotate in, left arm goes out, and then straight. One more time, in, right arm goes out, and then straight. Okay, I'm gonna turn around now. So, again, let's bring our right arm out like here, like this, and then left arm is on my waist. And rotate in, out, rotate, in, right arm goes out, rotate, in, and 
left arm goes up. Rotate. In. Right arm goes up. And rotate. In. And up. Rotate. In. And then up. Okay. So. I'm gonna do everything a little bit, uh, I'm gonna sh I'll show you the next thing what I want to do, but usually if you, if you never did this before, it's gonna, it's gonna take a little bit more time than this. So you keep working on that and you can rewatch the video again after the lesson. And guys, please uh, don't forget to share our lessons as well. Uh, so uh, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna show you how to start involving the arm movement, the styling, with the counting of international rumba. And then we're gonna slowly, gradually go into the steps, into the little routine that we did last time. Okay, so right now I'm gonna count with the movement of my arms, also without doing any steps. So, this is what we're gonna do. As I'm bringing my arm out here, I'm gonna go like this. I'm gonna go two, then I'm gonna go three, and then slowly, four, one, and two, three, and then four, one. Or like I mentioned last time, you can also count, if it's easier for you, you can count quick, quick, and then slow, quick, quick, slow. The goal is to make this movement continuous so I don't have uh, this kind of sharp movement but it's continuous motion that my arms are constantly moving. So this is a really good exercise whether you're a beginner or you're more advanced or you're dancing at a really high level it's really good exercise to learn or to warm up before your lesson or competition, uh, it's just really useful. And okay, so let me turn around now and I'm gonna do the same thing with the counting, moving my arms. So, I'm gonna go two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, and then two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one. Okay? Now, so let's try to apply this movement into what we were doing with our rumba routine. And if you missed my last lesson before, shame on you. But also, it's fine. Because I'm gonna go through the steps first of all here, and then we're gonna try to apply these arms into the routine, okay? So, again, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna start with the right foot uh, to the side with the kukaracha. Gonna go first of all without arms, just to go through the steps. Two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, and then two, three, Four, one. Now I'm gonna go right foot backwards into the rumble walk. Two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, and two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, and then two, three. I'm gonna turn four like this. I'm pointing my toe and my knee here is bent. And as I'm gonna move forward, I'm gonna step on the straight knee. One, and then I'm gonna to turn to the side like in a kukaracha. Two, three, four, one. Two, three, and then four. One, and two, three, four. One, two, three, four, one. From the beginning, okay? Now I'm gonna turn around, I'm gonna do the same routine, but I'm going to start using my arms. The same way we just did, but for a rumba. Okay, so here we go. I'm gonna start to the right side. And if I'm starting to the right side, 
my right arm is going to start also moving to the right side as well. So I'm going two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. I'm going to go right foot backwards now. So my right arm goes out. Two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Here, this is the position, and this is a four. So as I'm going to go step forward on one, I want you to bring your right arm straight. So it's gonna go one and two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. And then two, three, four, one. And I'm starting now from the beginning for one and two, three. So now, this routine and then uh, this routine plus the arms, things might get a little bit uh, complicated and uh, really hard. So what I suggest for everyone is to do this piece by piece. And probably the best start would be just to do a lot of cucarachas. The step that we were doing in the very beginning, involving our arms. Uh, because afterwards when we do everything, one step after another, uh, it's getting a little bit harder. So let me just do a couple times just to go just by itself. And so for the people that uh, this arm styling is completely new and maybe they're not just simply, they're not there yet, you can start practicing and working on that. So when we see you here on the floor, you already know what to do. And so you can start from that. So let me turn around and I'm gonna do a couple of just with the arm style. Okay? So let's do it all together. Again, we're going to start with the right side. And two, three, four, one. So this is where you should be on one. Your right arm is on the side. Your left arm is on your waist. Two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. Two, three. Four, one. My left arm is out, my right arm is here on my waist. And two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one. And two, three, four, one. Okay, so I hope that helps. Uh, keep practicing and keep working on that. I would really recommend starting uh, just with the arms. And for the people that, again, this is completely new, I would suggest that you start just with one arm at a time. So you can just go, let's say, quick, quick, slow. Or two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one. And then gradually start doing involving both of your arms and then only afterwards start doing that uh, include, uh, involving your steps as well. So this is a good way to really learn and apply the arm styling slowly into the routine, any routine, your own routine that you have. Okay, so I'm gonna do it again, including my arms. I'm gonna go through all of the steps the timing I hope you can guys can hear me well and uh, so I'm gonna go through all of the steps and I'm gonna do it pretty slowly okay and I think I'm gonna turn around so you have a better view here okay so in the beginning we're gonna go with the right foot to the side so I want all your body weight to be on the left foot so my weight is on the left foot and I go two three four one Two, three, four, one, 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 two, three, four,
two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, and now right arm goes to the side, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, and two, three, and then one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one. So this position will be the hardest. Two, three, four, one. But the arm styling is still the same. And two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. And then two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one. And then beginning. Two, three, four, one. So I think I, I spent most of the lesson facing the wall. I'm going to do it at least once facing you. So maybe that's also helpful so you can see my arms moving here. Just a little bit better than this, probably. Okay, so I'm gonna do it from the very beginning one more time. I'm gonna start to the right side. And two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. Now I go into rumble walks, but my arms are still moving the same way. Two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. And then two, three, four. And only as I step on one, my arm is gonna go completely straight, my right arm. And two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, and then two, three, four, one, and then I'm going from the beginning. Four, one, two, three. I definitely feel like I just had a good workout with my arms. Thank God for those live group classes that we were having on Facebook so uh, all of us, the teachers, could also kind of practice uh, with you guys together. So I'm really looking forward to seeing everyone coming here and showing what you managed to learn throughout uh, these two months.